What's going on folks? TCG back at it again with another video. Tonight at midnight in zone 18, pike and walleye open. We just pulled up to the good old Manatick bait. It's your daughter, I didn't really guy you can fish with. And like, biggin', biggin'. Giant walleye. We put to get some birds. We're gonna take some chats. I got Doyle behind the camera. He's gonna be shooting this for me. Get it, Maggie! Get it. What's going on folks? TCG back at it again with another video. It's going to be a different kind of video today. Uh, tonight at midnight in zone 18, pike and walleye open. And uh, a lot of you local guys, you know Manatick Bait Shop. Well, they host a event, a tournament type style. And uh, this takes place at 12.01 a.m. tonight or Saturday morning and goes to 2.30 in the morning. Um, basically, we all meet up in Manatick. It's $20 to enter and uh, you're you're fishing for the biggest walleye. So I have to go to the bait shop right now. I'm gonna grab some minnows for tonight, pay my fee to enter the contest. And, uh, and then you'll see us at the event at uh, midnight tonight. Uh, hopefully I can light it good enough that we can see. And hopefully the action is on and a lot of people can get fish and I can capture a lot of it on camera. So. For now, I'm just headed to the bait shop to get my bait and uh, pay the fees. Let's go. We just pulled up to the good old Manatick bait. We're getting ready for the fish off. Yes, sir. Oh, drop the minnow down there. I'll get, I'll get him later. <laughs> oh, it's a nice big bait. Give me a couple of big ones. Beauty. Seven. Two more. Awesome common china. Oh, minnows everywhere. Minnows everywhere. Dancing minnows. Yeah. Oh, here he is right here. Ah. There we go. That's that lucky guy right there. Lives to see another day. <laughs> let him go, let him grow, eh? Yep. <laughs> Take the wall out there. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to the tournament. What I really love is that all these big fish have to go back into the water now. And before, you never want people to go to Manatee Mill because it's such a good spot for big fish. And they'd like to take them home. Now you can't. So I don't mind telling everybody, go to Manatee Mill, catch your 8-pounder, 10-pounder, you'll be surprised. It's just a great fishery. And uh, the fact that we have to let them go just means more fish for uh, everybody else. Got these, like that. Cap the little tap on, like this. Nice and snug. These are good for days and days right in this bag. You need to keep them cold. Surprising what pure oxygen does. And cold water. Thanks, Dan, and I'll see you tonight. I'm getting excited. Oh yeah, hell yeah. It's just a, hopefully the wind dies down, but there's no wind. But, yeah. You know, even if it's windy, it's kind of protected. Yeah. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. My Take brother. care. <laughs> All right, so I just got my minnows, just got our worms. Dan hooked it up as always. He always gives a good uh, a good deal on the minnows. So it's time to take off, go walk the dog, and then uh, we're back at it. We're going to be at the mill, Manatick Mill, at uh, well, probably 11.30, 11.45. Get there a bit early, get ready, get rigged and then uh, get our lines in the water at 12.01 because that's when it opens, so. We've been crushing it. All right, folks, so we just pulled up to the Manatick Mill Fishing Tournament. Walleye opener is in approximately eight minutes. So we gotta get over there, introduce ourselves, say what up to everyone and get our lines in the water and ready to rock. Manatee Bates hosting this event. Thank you for doing that. So uh, let's get out there. Let's get after it. All right, folks. We're kind of lazy because it's you know 12 in the morning there. So we're using the circle hook and the weight, same setup we had for suckerfish for these walleye. But instead of a worm. Got a live bait. Got minnows. Which we attached them right below the dorsal fin on the spine. What you got going on there, man? What's going what, on? What you got going on there, man? <laughs> What's going on, buddy? Saw TCG. I'm like, I'll know someone. <laughs> We're fucking out here, bud. With the high waters, they could be just sitting down. In high current areas, what they'll do is they sit off to the side and like just to the calm, and then they just use their fins. And as like bait gets rushed through that they can't swoop through the high current, they'll just kind of like into the current, grab bait, back oh, yeah. out. 
<laughs> we out here, boy. Yo, Vista, because we out here. I don't want to be stuck because I'm out here. Because y'all knowing, out here, getting my money. It's a cow of hoeing. <laughs> All right, so we're here at the fish tournament, right? Our homeboy Corey's here, you know what I'm saying? You guys probably already saw that's in the video we out here. You know, I'm waving this knife around. I'm coming something in the eye, but you know, it's all good. Uh, ain't nobody got a thing. I'm sure somebody's gonna get something eventually. And I'm sure that somebody ain't gonna be me, but fuck it. Gotta give her a shot. I've broken off twice now. This is my third time putting the hook on. Not doing the circle hook anymore. Regular old jig head. There you go, jeez spit that one out and save my life. We're gonna try and go around to that corner of the building over there, hoping that some bait fish, sorry, not the bait fish, well, yeah, bait fish get knocked out and we'll float in there and hopefully there is walleye waiting for that to happen. You know, I'm just being lazy like most of us like to be, you know, I'm just on the couch eating potato chips and shit. So hopefully they're doing the same thing, just, you know, nature style. Nice. And you got the bobber. Yeah, and you got the bobber. Oh, Who's yeah, bobber is this? Are you serious? Yeah, Someone yeah. happy with I me? Saw it. I ran. Two pounds, I saw it. Three ounces. No problem. Yeah, it was two three. I didn't re tear it, so <laughs> it's, it was still two three. That's a no, three ounce sure. difference right there. Okay. Okay. So it's a two point three pounds. Wow. It's in the lead. Thanks. So far, so oh, good. Well, so I'm driving by, <laughs> and he pretends that he's going to set the hook on a fish as I'm driving by, and there's a fish on. Yeah. So he's, he's, like, I'm like, I he's like, oh my, my god, I I'm like, I look at my one. girlfriend, I'm like, look, this is Dan. Watch this. I'm like, hey, Dan. <laughs> and it's oh a fish. God, a fish. I can't believe yeah. it. No, yeah. totally like that. All right, so nobody's catching fish here at the dam. And one guy over there just caught a fish at the bridge. So you know we better go get up in his space and attempt to catch a fish. Those about to rock. Ha! We salute you. Is that a nice one? Yeah, it's a nice hike though. Hooked up again, buddy. Not rocket. <laughs> like D1. Oh, he's biting my arm. Oh, no. Timmy's on fire. He's my. Oh. Shut up, Ryan. He's. <laughs> you know there's rocks, right? <laughs> I know. Oh my god, Ryan's the only guy who's a fish here. And like. Biggin. 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 That's a big one. That's a big one. What is that? That's a big one, dude. Put it right. Bring him in the right if you can. That's a big. Oh, he got off. That was huge. That was huge, dude. Yeah. You didn't know what it was? I have no clue what the fuck that was, dude. No, that was fighting big. That felt like a giant walleye, bro. Might be the second place fish. Oh yeah, oh yeah, little Wally. Get him on the bank. That's the second place fish right there. Corey in with the land, let's go. Yes sir. You're gonna win some money. Can someone go run down there with a net for me? Yeah, Corey's on it. You're going you to the right or left? Oh yeah, I'm gonna go that way. Dude. Oh, oh dude. Oh. That's huge. Dude, that's like, oh man. Dude. Oh my God. I don't think that guy would be like a 23 inch guy. That's freaking big. That's a good one, dude. You're gonna be taking you first and second. Does anybody got a flashlight? Dylan, get over there with the flashlight. Yeah. Ours isn't that strong. Just as and the hand would be pretty nice. I can't see it either. 
Oh, that's a big one, dude. Dude, that's a stud, eh? Yeah. A fucking stud bag. Dude, that's a big one. There he is. I can't get him past off current. It's that current though, even on the other side too. Alright, fuck it, jump in. <laughs> I might do it. He's fighting like he wants to leave. Okay, I see him now. He's, uh, I can't get him past this bridge pile and in the current. Stupid six pound chest line. There he goes. Uh, John? Yeah. Oh. oh man. That was a stud. Nothing I could do. That was a giant. Yeah, you on, Dan? Yeah. How big is it, baby? Bring it on up. Just bring it up in the net. Just leave it in the net. Okay. Thank you, sir. Got it. All right. Oh, I wonder what it weighs. We're gonna both find it. And we're in under the wire too, eh? Yeah. I think with a couple of minutes left. We'll see. Yes, I've sir. never won anything on my own derby before. Am I allowed? <laughs> <laughs> uh oh, Timmy. I think it's as big as yours, eh? I think I beat you. Yeah? I don't know. It's going to be really close. It's going to be really close. Okay, I got to go get that weight in. Oh, fuck that's a nice Oh, well, we had another great evening, uh, you know, at this uh, annual walleye derby at midnight. Uh, winning weight, Tim Thompson, 2.3 pounder. Okay, uh, second weight, uh, 1 pound 15 ounces. I was lucky enough to grab that in the last five minutes. Uh, third fish was uh, 1 pound 4 ounces. Anyways, uh, we paid the top two cash prizes, and the winner also gets a nice rod and reel combo. Anyways, thank you very much, everybody. Lots of big ones were missed. We just couldn't get them up. Anyways, I had a great time. Thanks a lot. Well, folks, we just packed it in for the Derby at uh, Manatick Mill, Walleye Opener Zone 18, hosted by Manatick Bait Shop. The winning fish was 2.3 pounds, as you heard uh, from Dan, but there was plenty of fish caught and hooked that we just couldn't get it through the fast current to get it to the bank. I had a big fish on, didn't get to see what it was, but it felt big. It felt like a big walleye, uh, but I never got a look at it, and it popped off. Corey had a fish on, and it was a decent walleye. Probably would have took second or first place with that. It popped off and then the the other guy there who took first place caught an even bigger fish huge walleye and it popped off as well he could he had six pound test couldn't get through that current but plenty of fish were caught not many fish landed but it was still a great time out here so if you enjoyed this video make sure to hit that like button if you got any questions or concerns about this event leave a comment below because we love hearing from you guys if you ain't subscribed to the channel make sure to subscribe because we're dropping videos every week and hit that notification bell so you can be notified when the next video airs Thank you all for watching, and we'll catch you in the next one.